Hello everyone, this is Jeffrey, or Jeff, whatever you want to call me, uh, whatever, uh, back in episode 3 of Morrowind, a kind of a mostly blind playthrough. Don't really know what, what to look, actually, I would say mostly blind being like 95%, like I just know some lore, I've not actually really played the game. But we're back, uh, in Morrowind, we are in Saiyan Neen, Need? is it Neen or Need? Neen, uh, uh, Seda Neen, that's right. Seda, gosh dang it. <laughs> How long will it take me? How many episodes will it take me to stop doing this and just right click to close it? Who knows? Uh, last episode we talked to a bunch of people. We bought a sword. Um, we got some directions to give, go to Balmora and talk to a one, uh, Cusede, uh, Cas uh Caius Cusedes. Um, or Casades, or however you pronounce it. Um, there's other couple things. We got some Solstein information, which I think this is DLC. Um, which we will get to eventually, just not right now. Uh, we turned down a very shady deal, uh, where we basically had to go... Sound like we had to go find someone's uh, money they were hidden. They, they had hidden, but the person had been... Sh they were shaking him down constantly. So... Telenir the Just, a little bit of RP. I don't think, I don't think someone with the title the Just in their name would do something so heinous as as that, um, unless the name is ironic. That's possible. So today, hi, speak traveler. Okay, um, today we are going what's to start about? heading. What's this about? I'm just walking. Um, we're gonna head to Balmora. Uh, and start uh, getting, uh, hopefully getting some money, getting some uh, more uh, stuff. I can't actually read these signs. Uh, Hello, Oled, Gnar Mok, Vivek, Heligad, Sedanin, yeah, Ebonheart, Balmora. So this is north. I guess I could check this. So this road heads north. Did it again. House, house. Okay, yeah, there's... Oh, my dog is in the background barking. Oh, hold on just a second. Hopefully she'll stop. <laughs> if, if all of a sudden we just hear less of the massive sound in the back, uh, you know what that is, and I'll hopefully uh, get her stopped. But, uh, yeah, there's really doesn't look like there's a much going on in this town, so we're going to head north. Uh, I think the Silt Strider is, like, right here. If we die heading north, we'll... Ooh, I don't know, because we spent money. Gosh, dang it again. We spent money getting the sword, so I don't know if we'll have money to take the Silt Strider or not. Um, but for now, we're going to head north. Uh, along this road. I've been warned. Can I pick this stuff up? I can. How much... How much is this worth? Value one. I, I should start collecting things to sell. Um, the road... We're gonna stay on the road. Um, I've been warned of beasts and various things. Let's at least check out the Soul Strider and price check it. I'm not gonna take it right now. I think I wanna walk. Hi. This is the seaport village of Sedanin, Outlander. In the bitter coast region, I am Caravanner. Uh, and I manage the Silk Strider port here. Tell me your destination if you're looking for a ride, or if you're new to Sedanin. I can help you with local services or any specific place in Sedanin. Uh, Sedanin you're looking for. Or if you want someone in particular. Maybe I know where to look. Excuse me. I just had a, like, hiccup burp thing go on. So excuse me. Um, destination. I can take you by Silt Strider from Sedanin to Balmora, Vivek, Ganesh. Yeah, we already know that. Um, travel. Yeah, we don't have enough. We don't have enough, so we're gonna have to walk. And if we die... We make a special trip just for you. Same low price. Oh, thank you. Um, if we die, we'll, we'll obviously our save is right there. So we'll try to make some money. We'll see if we can make some money. I did lock myself out of one quest, but maybe there's some more quests in here I can make some money on. Um, but for now, let's try to get to Balmora.
This game does look very old. Well, I mean, it is. It's the early 2000s. And I think I think I saw 2002 is when it came out. So it does look very old, and the, the re like the render is very close. But there's, I don't know. I I still I still looking at this stuff. I enjoy the. I enjoy the the scenery. Maybe it's because I'm so used to like Skyrim's edges, just just mountains and gray kind of everywhere. But this is this is nice. And almost and even though I haven't played this game, this art, this this graphic style and. Uh, quality is is very nostalgic it, what is this are we enemy what are you yes you are Ooh. all right so it's dead doesn't have anything okay my health probably does not naturally regenerate so i should probably get uh, get a spell equipped. There we go. We got a spell equipped now. So, if I remember correctly, R to prepare to cast, and then click. Okay. Awesome. Um, does my magicka go up at all? Like, does his magicka slowly regen, or do you have to rest for that? So, let's look here. Uh, Vivek, Ebonheart, Heligad, Balmora. So, I need to follow this way. It doesn't look like my magic goes up. My magic it doesn't look like that naturally regens. I wonder if there's any items that regen magicka? Or maybe I don't know. I guess I'll find out. Again, I don't want to know. Like don't tell me, "Oh, you this is how you do it." Please I I don't want to know. Um uh, I'm sure it'll regen after resting. I'm sure everything kind of regens after resting, but if there's a way to do it in game while you're traveling, I, I, whoa, what is that? I don't want to mess with it. Um, if there is a way to do it while you're out and about throughout the day and not resting, I, I don't want to know. I, I want to find, I want to figure it out. All right, we got another crossroad here. Balmora is this way. The other thing that I like, and because this game doesn't have like a traditional fast travel system, and it's something that I that with Skyrim in the survival mode is a ton of fun, is it just makes the world feel much bigger. So do these two roads go around Pelagiad? 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 I don't know. Balmora is this way though. And we're going to this corner club or something? This corner club this corner club is called South Wall. Okay. And that's in the eastern part of uh the eastern part of Balmora, I think I said. I mean I'll ask a guard or someone when I get there, but Oh, this isn't too bad. This road I say that now. This road it hasn't been too bad. We fought one enemy. And they they really weren't bad. That looks like a mine or a dungeon or something. Not going in there right now. I'd like to get some armor. Um before I really start going into dungeons and things. I mean if I have to do a dungeon run or something as part of a quest to initially get get gold then that's fine but i would rather there's a person there i bet you're a bandit aren't you i bet you are and of course all right let's let my fatigue regen i'm gonna pull this out what is what is sneaking look of so this is crouch this is this is the sneak crouch here interesting We won't be doing that too much, honestly. This is not a sneaky. Oh, this is not a, a sneaky character. All right, I think we're good. We can probably do this. Maybe this person will have some gold, uh, unless they're not an enemy. They they might not be. Hello. Are we cool? 
Well met. Well met. Marie Aramin. You're interesting. Begging your pardon, have you seen a bandit nearby? I must find him. Journal has been updated. Bandit nearby? Yes, I was just walking along here, minding my own business. Suddenly, a bandit jumped out at me from behind. He was a dark elf. A strong, dashing dark elf. He didn't, he didn't harm me in any way, although he did take my jewels. He was quite gentle and talked to me for what seemed like forever. Wait. So she fell for this guy, and he stole from her. Yeah, let's do it. I will try and find this man, if only for love's sake. Marie's left glove has been added to your inventory. Okay, do I have any directions, though? Uh, you'll try? Thank you so. I'm, sh I'm sure you'll be able to find him. He mentioned something about having to head north, so I imagine he might be found in Pelagiad. Please, if you find him, give him this glove for me as my token of my love. I'm certain he will want to find me again, so I need to, this, this will send me to Pelagiad. Okay, so we can do that once we leave Balmora. Oh, and she did take her glove off. Look at that. Sorry, I thought you were a bandit. I thought you were, we were going to fight, but you're cool. We're all good. We are all good. The pace is so slow. And if I, I have to use the sprint to uh, move, but if I come in contact... Okay, now where do I go? Is this gonna... That leads to, like, a mine. Okay, so I need to go this way. It's raining for a while. Or maybe it just probably just feels like a while. <laughs> you know, as far as the video goes, I could cut the travel. But... And, and, and I imagine... Travel will be much more dynamic later on as we go. Uh, and it's just kind of slower right now because we're only level 1. Uh, we're just, just beginning. Why is my magic... Why is my spell going down? You see it on the bottom left. Big old rat. We got signs here. There's a red bar underneath my spell. It's setting me up there. And it's going down. Oh, no. Does it go down with my stamina? Because it's going back up now my, as my fatigue is coming back up. Interesting. All right. We got to fight. I'm sure. Yep. Awesome. Got anything for me? No. Wait. Dispose of corpse. Oh, so you can just get rid of it. Okay, cool. Alright, let's prepare to cast. Probably was unnecessary, honestly, but that's okay. I, I'm getting my restoration skill up as well. And it's a major skill of mine. Nope, nope. It's a major skill of mine, so... It'll help. If, it, if the leveling works the way it does in Oblivion, which I'm not sure... To level up, you have to level up your major skills. I don't know if leveling up the minor skills help or not, but uh, I'm sure the major ones do. Okay, so we've got like a very char- Are we at- We're probably at the foot of Red Mountain here, is my guess. Okay. My unarmored skill. Up to six. Alright, so I had a couple misses in there. Let's- Let's take it. Yeah, we're not- Balmora is probably that way. Caldera, Balmora, Ghost Gate. Okay. What's that little... I wonder what that little blue box is down next to the mini-map on the bottom right. Got another enemy up in front of us. Caldera, Balmora. Okay, so we don't need to go that way. What is that? Are those like little ash spawn? Not ash spawn. Uh, oh, what are they called? I, I think e I think they're in ESO, but I've not played ESO in like years. Probably like four years since I played ESO, so I don't even remember what they're called. 
Alright, so we got structures up in front of us. What do we got here? I assume this is Balmora. Let's see. Uh, yeah, this is 100% Balmora. No? Oh, no, this is a Legion Fort. Okay. That looks cool. I do like the design. I like how I like the con I like the contrast of the clean buildings to the swampy kind of desolate area that is Marlin. And you can see, like the moss that's growing up on it. I like it. So I gotta keep going, Belmora. We'll probably come back here at some point. But my goal for this episode is to get to Balmora and uh, get to that corner club at least. Balmora is this way. Oh, I, did, I guess I did take damage from that rat. I could heal. Okay. My magic... I have three casts, so I'm, I, I can get about six casts of that restore health. Uh, for Magical Bar right now. This is Balmora, right? This looks like a city. There's a Silt Strider. Yeah, there's a Silt Strider there. They said the Silt Strider can take you to Balmora. So we made it. We made it. These things are so cool. Welcome. Why, thank you. I am out of stamina. Whoa, what in the world? Huh. Argonians walk differently. Interesting. All right. Very low to the ground building, square roofs. Interesting choice to take uh, to choose ro uh, rooftops that are squared off. It's not like we're in a desert area. It is raining quite a bit. All that, uh, all that weight from rain and any ash that would come out of Red Mountain would probably be really heavy on these rooftops. Uh, okay, so this right here, do we have Mage's Guild? Uh, yeah, Mage's Guild. I was saying it looks like a Mage's Guild symbol, and that must be Fighter's Guild as well. Yep. Fighter's Guild, Mage's Guild. So we can probably uh, check that out while we're here. Woo! Athletic skill increased to 11. Woo! Let's go. Um, so let's look. Uh, previous... My orders are to go to the town of Amura, South Wall, part of the called South Wall. And they said it's on the east, right? The eastern side of Balmora, so that's the south, so I need to go this way. So I need to cross the river. It's called South Wall, so I imagine it's going to be along that southern wall. Let's cross the river. Okay, this town is is not as big as I thought. That's the edge of it. I thought it was going to be a lot bigger. But it's still, like for the time period this game came out, it's still a good sized town. Alright, so is this it? Or is this a house? That's a house, okay. I imagine this place will probably have like a sign or something. Yep, right here. Awesome. Is this the person we're supposed to talk to? Don't press your luck. Or what? Honor, honor. Kajit has no time for you. Sugar lips. <laughs> probably a reference to moon sugar, but it's still honor among thieves.
You have just questions. making sure the person I'm looking for isn't actually in here. No, I think I had to talk to someone in, in here about Caius. And I think it was this lady over here. Hurry this up, will Don't you? Don't press your luck. You're on your honor. I'm on my honor. Okay, greetings, citizen. I'm Sol... I'm Sotild. Welcome to Balmora. We're... We, we are a house of... Hel Gosh. Halalu Town and loyal citizen of the Empire. What can I do for you? Um, looking for Caius Cassides. That old sugar tooth? <laughs> okay. I'm not sure where he's living now, but you can ask Bacola Closius, the owner. He'll know. Okay. Okay, um, we'll probably come back and talk to you here in a minute. So the owner... Oh, I keep getting stuck on the corners. Is this it? Wait, who did she say? Bacola Closius. Bacola Closius. So not you. Not you. Any time now. Only, only he stands there. Interesting. Is Bacola Closius in here? What say Upstairs? you? Upstairs. Aha! There you are. Good day. I'm Bacola Closius, publican. Ooh, so you're a tax collector uh, of of the South Wall here in Balmora. We rent, right? Publican. That's 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 that was uh, another name for a tax collector. Um, uh, unless they serve a different role uh, in the Empire. Uh, this Empire. And I have a limited selection of goods for barter. If you're new here, I can also tell you where to look for other services or a specific place nearby. If you're looking for someone in particular, I may be able to help. Hey, guess what? I am actually looking for someone in particular. Old Caius rents a little bed and, and basket. Bed and basket. Interesting. Just up the hill on the north edge of town. Go out the front door. Not the upper door to the terrace. Wait, go out the front door, not the upper door to the terrace. Then right up the stairs, then left at the top of the stairs, and down to the end of the street. Go out the front door, not the upper door. So out the front door, then right up the stairs, then left at the top of the stairs, and then down at the end of the street. Okay. Good lord. Okay, directions. Let's see if I can remember these. Uh, actually, let's write these down. Because uh, <laughs> I don't know if they're going to be saved to my journal, necessarily. It might just say... I, I guess we can look at the journal. Let's see. Yes. Uh, okay, no, they're right here. Uh, thank thankfully, I don't actually have to write them down. Go right up the stairs from the front door. Okay. Left at the top of the stairs and down at the end of the street. Okay. This, this is the front door, right? Right up the stairs. Then left. Right? Then left at the top of the stairs. And down the end of the street. So it must be this here. It's nighttime. Door to sky. I guess if you knew where you are going, you probably don't even have to go to the corner club. What's this about? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to barge in. Like... What was that? Okay. Uh, what? Yes, I am Caius Cassades. But what do you mean? You were told to report to Caius Cassades. What are you talking about? Report to Caius Cassades. So you say your name is Tillinir the Just, and you've been and you've been told to report to me and deliver a package. Perhaps you'll let me look at it. Uh, yeah. Yes, very interesting. So it says here the Emperor wants me to take make you a novice in the blades. Oh, you're a blades agent. Okay. And that means you'll be following my orders. Are you ready to follow my orders, Tillinir the Just? I guess I'm in the blades now. Okay. Uh Good. Welcome to the service. Novice Tellinir the Just. Now you now you belong to the blades. We're the Emperor's eyes and ears in the provinces. You can use my bed if you need to rest, but leave my personal stuff alone, unless I say otherwise. If you like, you can improve your modest skills with our Blades trainers now, 
Or if you're in a hurry, I can give you orders right away. But don't forget to visit the Blades Trainers. Okay, so we're in a faction right off the bat. That's pretty cool. Um, we are in the Blades. Moon, moon Sugar. Um, someone in here is doing drugs. Okay. <clears throat> Skooma Pipe. Oh, buddy. Well, where oh. did I put that? Oh, buddy. Uh, so, I looks like I might have been sent here not only for me to become part of the Blades, but to give you, like, purpose. You seem a little, uh, down on your luck there, bud. I guess they did call you, old, what, Sugarless or something? Uh, Old Sugar Tooth. Uh, hey. Well, that will do it for this episode of, uh, of our mm. Morrowind playthrough. Uh... I don't really know what we're going to do next episode. We're going to see uh, where this takes us. Maybe we'll hit some Blades Trainers, though I need money. Uh, I don't have money, uh, and I'm sure the Trainers are going to charge, and seven gold is probably not going to be enough. Uh, so I'm going to need to go find some quests somewhere. Uh, maybe, maybe actually, maybe I'll go up to the Fighters Guild. Um, maybe I'll go to the Fighters Guild and get some stuff going there. Um but yeah, that is our episode for today. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm excited to see what else Marwin holds for us. We've not gotten very deep. We are still level one. Um, I know the leveling is very much slower in this. But again, thanks for watching. Um, and I will see all of you guys next time.